Elementary schools across the country are debating whether or not homework is beneficial for young students. It's a topic that can divide parents and teachers. Nikki Batiste reports. How you doing? When fourth grader Judah Broshi gets home from school, he doesn't have to hit the books like most kids. Do you have any homework today? Nope. His New York City public school has banned mandatory homework for grades kindergarten through fourth. The idea is that Judah's mother Robin pushed for the policy after seeing how much her son pushed back on doing the work. It started to become something that I spent a lot of time kind of thinking about and obsessing about why I was having had to have this contentious relationship with my child about homework. Dr. Harris Cooper of Duke University has been studying homework for years and says doing away with it completely is not a good idea. Studies do show that even small amounts of homework help kids do better on unit tests, but they also help to begin shape the child's uh, time management skills, their organization. Dr. Cooper also believes homework improves self-discipline and achievement, but he cautions moderation is key. Teachers have a rule that they call the 10 minute rule. You take a child's grade, you multiply it by 10, and that's how much time the students should be spending. For fourth grader Judah, that would mean about 40 minutes of homework a night. His mother says families should get to decide how to spend their time. There are people that want to do multiplication flashcards with their kids, and that's great. And they should do those things, but it shouldn't be mandatory. Judah School does recommend that all students read about 30 minutes a night, something he does enjoy. Nikki Batiste, CBS News, New York. And for kindergartners, ex experts suggest occasional short, fun tasks parents and children can do together. Stick